Hello there everybody, welcome back to our channel Reptiles with Love and if you are new please be sure to hit that little subscribe button down below so you don't miss our future videos. I'm Scott. I'm Clara, otherwise known as Life with Fish. So in today's video we're going to be talking a little bit about our baby crested geckos. And we're also going to be speaking a little bit about our praying mantis. So here we have our crested gecko babies, they are only a month and a half old so they are still quite small. As you can see, their tank is quite small. Um, we'll go take them out so we can give you a better look at them. So here we have our two babies. As you can see, they are very small, quite jumpy, but I love them nonetheless. Oh. Come on, jump over, yay. Yeah. There we go, look. So we are not sure if they are male or female yet because they are too young to sex. They are currently on Pangea, Banana and Apricot. It's what the breeder gave us. They love it. <laughs> We're currently giving them baby dubias. They seem to love them. We do dust them in calcium powder with the tree. So they do require higher humidity than let's say a leopard gecko, so I spray them down twice a day. They do get their water from that, but I do also provide a water dish for them just in case they want to have a little drink. They love having stuff to climb and they jump around, so there is some leaves in here that they can climb on, which they are always on that or in the lid of the tank, but it's so adorable. So guys, do remember, due to stress, the crested geckos can lose their tail. And it does be called a frog butt. <laughs> so now that we've talked a little bit about these guys and you've actually seen them up close, let's move on to our next animal, which is our praying mantis. So here we have my praying mantis, it is a DIY enclosure that I've done myself. I soldered out a big hole in the lid and then glued mesh, plastic mesh onto it. So there's lots of ventilation going through his tank. So let's have a little look at him. Here is our praying mantis. She eats small crickets um, every two days. She is very smart. She's looking at me right now. But I love her bright green colour. They do require higher humidity, as like the crested geckos, so I do spray them down. Well, we'll say him every night. She eats small crickets. Did I say that? No, no. <laughs> she is just so amazing to watch. Focus. So if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up and leave a nice comment down below because we love hearing from you guys. It really means a lot. And myself and Scott will chat to you in our next video. Bye bye.